the superficial muscles are trapezius and latissimus dorsi, deeper the rhomboid and the serratus anterior muscle. The tissue plane deep to the rhomboid extends medially deep to the erector and laterally deep to the serratus anterior. The tissue plane deep to the serratus extends medially deep to the erector spiny. Place a linear transducer in the transverse orientation over the medial border of the scapula. Identify the trabezius, rhomboid, and intercostal muscles. Then rotate the ultrasound probe 90 degree to the sagittal plane and identify the tissue plane between the rhomboid, intercostal muscles, and the ribs. Then advance the needle in plane through the trabezius and rhomboids in a craniocaudal direction. Then inject 10 to 20 ml of local anesthetic in the facial plane between the rhomboid and the intercostal muscles and ribs. The local anesthetic spread deep to the scapula and serratus anterior muscle targets the lateral cutaneous branches and spread medially deep to the rectospine. To identify the subserratus plane, move the transducer caudally and laterally, distal to the inferior angle of the scapula. Identify the latissimus dorsi, serratus anterior, intercostal muscles between ribs. Then advance the needle in plane, directed caudally and laterally. Inject. 10 to 20 ml of local anesthetic in the tissue plane between the serratus anterior and external intercostal muscle and ribs. The local anesthetic spread deep to the serratus anterior muscle craniocaudally and spread laterally targets the lateral cutaneous branches and spread medially deep to the rectospiny muscle. Both approaches can be used as a single shot or with catheters. The level of injection can be adapted to the anatomical location of pain, rhomboid intercostal for T2 to T6 dermatomal coverage, subserratus for T6 to T12 dermatomal coverage.